It's, been a, it's a tremendous tradition to have the Tommy Evans Invitational every year. You know, as you said, it's uh, 53rd year. Uh, you know, every year we try to gun for that, usually our first meet. And uh, it always means something, not only from tradition it's had, but our first time to get out and uh, see what we can do. Talk about the, the, how the team's with it so far. You've got a great mix of veteran returners, some of whom have got an extra year along with some newcomers. Just talk about what you've seen so far. Well, it is true. We have a pretty good mixture this year. We have, uh, at this meet, we'll probably have about six freshmen running, and we'll have six uh, uh, veterans running. Uh, we've got a large group. We still have some. We have to kind of hold off the side a little bit with some, you know, little nicks and injuries there. Hopefully we can get them a little bit later in the season. But, uh, you know, it's a good group. We bring back everyone from last year uh, in terms uh, – and then, of course, we bring in some, some new kids that we hope are able to uh, – add to the strength of our program. Just talk about the excitement of getting to go out to the dedicated course in Norton to host this meet every year. Well, we really like our course. You know, the um, uh, Silver Lake Cross Country Course is, you know, it's a park just dedicated to cross country. Uh, we've got a big sign as you go out there. It says, uh, you know, home course of the Akron Zips. And when we go through there, that gets our athletes pretty excited. and. Uh, about the chance that they have such a great course run. It's a beautiful, uh, well manicured, uh, great for all kinds of different races, fun to watch from a spectator standpoint. And uh, so being able to get out there and race on it, you know, our kids, you know, not only because it's first meet, but they love to be at home. And we usually get a pretty good group of people to come out and watch our cross country meets. And uh, we're excited to, this year with you know, a little less on some of the restrictions that you know, we can have a bigger uh, bigger crowds and bigger groups and so our athletes can uh, you know see what they can do